Hey, good morning. You know, by now, most police departments in Southwest Ohio have heard from the Urban League Center for Social Change. They are working with departments that are looking to usher in some reforms one department at a time. The protests last summer over the death of George Floyd led to the launch of the Center for Social Justice. It's really a rare center that many Urban League chapters don't have. It's here to help any local police department work on issues that create a division between police and the community. We're talking about issues like racial profiling, use of force, accountability and community oversight. Now there are about 45 different police agencies here in Hamilton County alone and the center has contacted all of them to offer assistance. They're also doing a lot of research to understand what's happening in different departments. We want to see everybody's data um, because especially with these uh, smaller departments, they're not publishing it on their website like the city of Cincinnati. So to uh, first identify if there's an issue, you have to look at the data. So we're collecting that data. We're collecting policies. Raquel Howard Smith couldn't say which departments they are working with, but she said they are working with about 10 police agencies so far and several others have made inquiries. One area many seem to be interested in is community oversight. Now that involves residents working with police chiefs and city leaders on reforms. Now, of course, they're using the Citizens Complaint Authority, which was born out of the collaborative agreement as a blueprint for several of these departments. And they would also like to make sure that departments are using de-escalation training, which actually is required by the state of Ohio. In downtown Cincinnati, Lisa Smith, WCPO 9 News.